Come here, big guy. Gotcha. Alright. Now, what we're doing before is we're heading over to Havel. Gotcha. Battle axe. We kill this guy because uh, we don't want any of these motherfuckers following us to Havel. Because Havel is enough of a, of a problem by himself. Gotcha. Alright, so we're going to take this off and we're going to put this on because, like I said, Havel is a problem. Oh, I can get light roll. Sweet. Havel is a problem, and we need a shield to deal with him, because he is a big problem. Oh yeah, we use the master key to open this door. This is, like I said, leads us up to where the uh, the Taurus demon was. We're going to head downstairs. This big-ass watchtower. Nothing on this floor. Now, this is not going to be a pretty fight. Just so everyone knows, this is not going to be a pretty fight at all. I'm going to backstab fish him. Just like I did with the uh, the Black Knight. Just basically pure disrespect. Look at him. Come here, big guy. As you can see, he looks pretty crazy. Come on, big guy. And if he hits me with that thing, I think I'll just die. So, we're going to backstab Fish's ass. He... Ooh, just like that. And see, he is also very, very strong. That was a backstab. It's not going to be a pretty fight. But it's going to be a fight that we're going to win. Hopefully. Come on, Havel. See, his armor's made of rock. No wonder he's called Havel the Rock. What are you doing? Okay, if you're not going to move... I'll capitalize on that. <laughs> Ooh, the WAP. Let's go. Yeah, it looks like he was just tri fucking chiseled from stone. Ooh, okay. I would like you to get a little closer to me. Oh, see, that took all my stamina to block that. If, he, if that if that attack, if my shield was a little weaker, that attack would have hurt me through the block. Come on. Come on. Ah! Okay. Oh, that was dangerous. Goodbye. I think that's it. Eat it. Havel's ring. Havel's ring. Boosts maximum equipment load. This ring was named after Havel the Rock, Lord Gwyn's old battlefield compatriot. So, he knows the god of sunlight, Lord Gwyn. Havel's men wore the ring to express faith in their leader and to carry a heavier load. Also explaining that Havel wasn't the only person to wear that armor. He was the one who made the armor... Or, you know, the armor's namesake. But he did have men who wore this ring and the armor to kind of, you know, as a sign of honor. So, now we have a lot more equipment load. So we'll go ahead and take a look at it. Our equipment load is now 80 pounds, basically, right? So, if I take it off, and we go back, it's 53 pounds. So, it's like, I don't know, 40%? That's... Really, really fucking good. So we're going to put this back on. We might be able to get away, just an example, we might be able to get away with like wearing some more shit now. See? And still keep a light roll. Now let's see. Let's try just putting on like a helmet, just to see. See? And I still have my light roll. But the difference is, is that this helmet made me look like a fucking stupid idiot. So we're not going to wear this helmet. But can we wear these balder gloves? We can. So now we're a little bit more armored up. We can take a little bit more damage. 
And there's also another path we can take down here. Use the master key. Where does this lead us? Dark Root Basin. See a waterfall over there? See what looks like a path? And if you notice that, that is the church where Andra is. So I showed you this area, but we're actually not going to come through this way. Because I don't like to come through this way. So we're going to head back upstairs. Um, and we're going to head back to Andre, essentially, is what we're going to do. Uh, because I would like to head through Darkroot Basin through the path that Andre has. Which is right past that big-ass demon uh, Titanite monster that we fought. Titanite demon, sorry. Um, and... Uh, we're going to head to the catacombs here soon. Uh, I'm probably going to finish up any stuff in the Undead Burg. Uh, just this version of the Undead Burg, not the lower Undead Burg. Because um, I would like to do the catacombs and then do the lower Undead Burg. But the catacombs is like... That place is tough, but there's a lot of good shit there. Oh god. Okay. Um, actually, let's go talk to the merchant over here. I don't remember if he has a name. But we'll go talk to him. Maybe we'll buy some from him. Yeah. Hello, soldier wastecloth. Okay. Kill this asshole so he doesn't bother us. Gotcha. Okay. Oh, there you are. Still keeping your marbles all together? Absolutely. Go ahead. Don't be a nitwit. Easy, bro. It hurts to splurge when your days are numbered. <laughs> Alright, what else can we get from you? We're gonna buy, uh... We're gonna buy the bottomless box. We're not gonna buy the repair box right this second. I don't care about the chain armor. Um... We could buy a bunch of arrows, though. I have a bunch of bolts. I got a bunch of arrows. You know what? Um, yeah, we are going to buy a shit ton of these arrows. Because there's something I'm going to show off. Probably not this episode. Oh, shit. Um, but I'm definitely going to show it off. I pro 200 arrows is probably okay. Let's buy 250. That should probably be enough. Um, need anything from here? I don't need any of this shit. Don't need any of this shit. A couple of these couldn't hurt. Yeah, my wares. Of course they're stolen. What did you think? And when you lose your head, I'll sell it all again. <laughs> Thanks, pal. Good to know you're looking out for me. Oh, this one. Ain't she lovely? Her name is Yulia. She's plumb in love with me. You'd never leave my side now, would you, Yulia? Now, we don't actually know what he's talking about. When he says Yulia, it's with a capital, you know, so it's it's something... A lot of people think uh, that if you kill this this merchant, sorry to be somewhat rambling, if you kill this merchant, you'll get a special katana called an Uchi katana. It's the only way you can get it in the whole game by killing this guy because he has it. Uh, if if I attacked him right now, he would he would use it on me. Uh, a lot of people think that maybe the katana was supposed to be sitting in that in that that bucket right there, but maybe it's just not modeled correctly. So some people think that maybe he's referencing his katana and that. It would never turn on them because it's a fucking inanimate object, but... Oh, you can forget it. I'm all that she needs. Careful! She'll bite your little fingers off. Be kind, Yulia, be kind! <laughs> or maybe he's talking about a weird animal that we don't know about. Yeah, I'm not here to check. We talk business. Yeah, and now he's repeating the fuck off. Oh, then come back soon. <laughs> yeah, man. Um, do I have a bow? Uh, fuck me, I don't have a bow. I think I should buy one pro from him, probably. I, hope you <laughs> I did bring plenty of souls, my friend. I need to buy a bow from you. Do you sell a bow? You sell a short bow. Thank you. Thank you, kind. <laughs> okay. Um, you know what? Fuck it. Maybe I will show off uh, the fucking dragon. Just because. Uh, so we'll rest here.
because I mean shit if I if I don't do it now I'm just gonna have to do it later you can shoot the tail off the Hellkite Drake in the same way I cut the the tail off the Belfry Gargoyle um, you can shoot the tail off the Drake and it'll get you a really really good weapon now the real question is do I have enough equipment load to wear the short bow here we go he's back So see, there's a shitty tail right there, and that's what I have to shoot. Oh man, is he gonna jump here every fucking time? Oh man, I don't remember that shit. Where's your tail at, asshole? Head back over there. Now this is not a pretty way to do it. Are you seriously gonna do this every time? Oh, got him on that quick draw. Oh, wow, that only took like 50 shots. Oh, shit, okay. What if that was patched? Cause I feel like that used to take way more. All right, the Drake Sword. All right, let's 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 show this. Uh, I don't want those arrows. Interesting that if I have the, uh, the quiver on, it actually shows the quiver. Kind of cool. All right, so we'll look at the lore for the Drake Sword. Um, I don't know if there's much on it. It's a damn good sword, though. That's 200 damage base, but as you can see... Under parameter bonus, it has no scaling whatsoever. So if I look at my magic sword, I got C in strength, C in dex, C in faith. It has no scaling, but its base attack is much, much stronger. This sword, one of the rare, rare, <laughs> rare dragon weapons, is formed by a drake's tail. Drakes are seen as underdeveloped imitators of the dragons, but in, but in they are likely their distant kin. The sword is imbued with a magic powers to be released when held with both hands. So I'll show you. Oh, got the wrong weapon. All of the dragon weapons have special moves associated with them. And they take a lot from their durability. So my durability is 360. I also don't have enough strength. I need 16 strength. But if I two-hand it, I can hold it. My durability is 360. Um... I'll explain the strength thing, I suppose. See, I have 13 strength. I need 16. But because strength is like actual strength, like how strong my arms are, if I two-hand a weapon, that get, that cuts down my strength like requirement to like half. Because the way that I assume the game internalizes it is that's the strength in one hand. I have 13 strength in one hand. So if I use two hands holding the sword, I can then actually use it because I'm getting more strength from my other hands. See, if I take it out of two hands, I can't hold it. Put it in two hands, I can't hold it. Now this is its special move. Let's show it off. Pretty cool. But it takes a lot of my durability to do it. So two times took 60 durability. Very cool, but I don't really care for using it. I don't like the fact that it has no uh, scaling. But it's definitely a damn good weapon. That used to be the strat back in the day, was for everyone to just buy the short bow, or pick up the short bow, or start with the short bow, and then just use that shit. I did it too. You can fuck Havel up with that sword. Ow. Damn it, none of you assholes gave me any fucking humanity. But, uh, yeah, not bad. We're gonna crawl back up here. I think we're pretty much finished, uh, up, now that I showed that off, in the, uh, Undead Berg, the Upper Undead Berg. Can't think of uh, anything else that 
I need to do besides go down to the lower Undead Burg. So, uh, we're probably going to do... I'm going to head over to Andre. And we're either going to do the Catacombs next time or Darkroot Basin. I would like to do the Catacombs, but like I said, that's kind of a problem in itself. We're definitely going to do the Catacombs. It's just a question of whether or not we're going to do it now or we're going to do it a little later. But if we do it now, we'll get some special content. So realistically, we're probably going to do it now. Uh, I'm going to kill these Balder Knights, though. Just to see if I can get that sweet blade. Give me that sword. God fucking damn it. I hear something. Oh, it's you. You want some, pal? Yeah. Of course, you didn't drop me anything. <laughs> Fucker. Damn it, you guys suck. Once you drop me anything, you assholes. All right. Oh. Ah. Let's parry. Oh. Come on, big guy. Thank you. But yeah, um... Yeah, I think we're pretty much done. I, got, I suppose I can go over any of my weapons to see if I talked about any of that. Oh, I'll show off this too. Even if I two-hand this Y-hander, I still don't have enough strength. I believe it needs 24. Yeah, so it's not exactly double my strength. Maybe it's like 1.5 my strength if I two-hand. Um, this weapon, I'm swinging it really fucked up because I don't have enough strength. But it's a very, very good weapon. I use this weapon many times. But we're going to take it off. We're going to put my uh, magic hell blade back on. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we've went over everything. Uh, I don't think there's anything on the... Oh, the binoculars do mention that it was crafted in Astora. Pretty interesting. I don't think we got any more key items. Shit. Shit. Nah, nah. No, okay. Let's head down here and rest. I suppose I'll pop a soul so we can uh, grab a level. Is this enough? I think that should be enough. I need, I need fucking like six souls. I don't even care. Don't even care. We're just gonna pop one of the big ones. Out of spite. All right. Let's get some health. You can never go wrong with health. All right. Thank you all for watching. We will see you next time.